This is Charles Bronson, dubbed one of the most notorious and violent offenders in the UK. He's even had films made about him. Sighty on the age. It was madness at its very best. Yes, that's Tom Hardy. This week he has a parole hearing and he wants out of jail. He says that he can taste freedom. I can actually smell and taste freedom like I've never ever done it in life. But is that likely to happen? So Bronson never actually killed anyone. So what's led to him spending almost five decades in prison? So let's get back to the beginning. In 1974, he was just 22 and went by his birth name, Michael Jordan Peterson. He was involved in an armed robbery and jailed for seven years. Now, while he was locked up, it's fair to say he didn't take much of a liking to prison life. And that has led to 17 more convictions, taking 11 hostages and attacking more than 20 inmates and guards. And the list goes on. He's been known to make weapons out of broomsticks, damage prison property and even scale the wall to get on the roof. Surprisingly, he was let out of jail in 1987, but ended up back in there after 69 days for robbing a jeweler's, being involved in bare knuckle fights and fighting a Rottweiler. <laughs> this is when he started going by Charles Bronson, named after this Hollywood actor. In 1996, he took some inmates hostage and in 1999, when his art teacher dared criticise his artwork, he took him hostage too. Side note, Bronson's been quite the creative in jail. Some of his artwork has been sold at auctions and his poetry has won awards. And given his artistic flair, he changed his name to Charles Salvador after renowned artist Salvador Dali. In 2018, he was cleared of trying to harm a prison governor. The court heard he'd threatened to bite his nose off and gouge his eyes out. Ouch. But Bronson, who represented himself in court, said it was just a bear hug that went wrong. Recently though, he says that he's changed. In a Channel 4 documentary about him, he claimed to be anti-crime and anti-violence now. Bronson is now age 70. He, his family and his supporters believe this public parole hearing, the court will prove he's not a danger to others. If that's proven, that could mean the end of this long stint in prison for Bronson and he could be out on license.